in a bigger picture, there's this concept that uh, a nation state like China, and China has said globally that their economic system is superior to that of Western capitalism. Yes. And when you, when you peel back uh, the onion, you see that there is no larger income and wealth dispersion yeah. than there is in China because the elites are the kleptocrats and the people have very little. Yeah. And those that actually rise through the ranks of this hybrid system end up going to jail um, or falling off a wall in, yeah. in Provence, yeah. Yeah. right? But that's a very important distinction to draw uh, when you look at the economy of the CCP versus the economy of Western capitalism, yeah. right? 100% correct. So I'd love, to, I'd love to ask you uh, a couple of questions about that. You know, even Premier Li um, has stated that Chinese economic statistics are unreliable. Mm. What do you think uh, the real economic statistics are as far as GDP growth? And I know you and I have had several conversations about the FX reserves. Mm -hmm. How do you think about the numbers that are reported for GDP growth versus what they really are and the FX reserve number versus what it really is? I know that's a specific question, but we'll move, move on from there. Yeah, thank you, sir. It's a good question. You know, we need to look for China economy. We need to look for four points. Four points, yeah. One is the M2. M2, how much? Yes, basically cash in circulation, right? Yeah. For those that, are, that aren't economists. Yes, $20, 20, $29 trillion China printer RMB, we call CCPB currency. Yes. Secondly, you need to look for about China. It's the personal interest growth, right? Yes. No, no 29 trillion, this no growth too much. Three, you need to look for bank, the bad bank. The bad bank. Bad bank. Yes. 45%. 45% of the loans are More, bad. More, I think. Yeah. Four, it's very important, you see, uh, foreign exchange. Yes. Currency. Currency exchange. Uh, exchange. Yes. Up, down, down. You look at Hong Kong, the dollars, with dollars. Yes. RMB with dollars. Nobody, no Chinese, no also American uh, company in China can move, you know, pure clean money go to outside. Correct. Correct. Even you earn this money, cannot move outside. Why? So this is the full point. I give you answer. Nobody can give China economy go to stable. Reliable, impossible. They now just jump in. They cheat the world. They make a fake economy. They have this a is fake the printer, the currency. Then you know control the currency, move to outside. Yes. So you've moved. You've taken us to the place that brought you and I together. Yes, this right? is correct. Right. Yeah. You came to this conclusion um, long ago, and you're right. Uh, I think you're right, of course, because you agree, you, you agree with me. So you therefore, you're the right. money. <laughs> <laughs> so this, this concept of two currency worlds is one that is lost on many people. Yeah, all of uh, the, the RMB economy of China uh, mm. is internal. Yeah. And the economy of yeah, China in, in, in dollars same. is external. Yeah. And they're desperately in need of dollars because that's how they trade with the rest of the world. Mm -hmm. what, what was so compelling when I met you, the most compelling thing that you showed me was the chart of Chinese M2 the moving graphic, yes. and uh, we'll provide that moving graphic to the Real Vision audience uh, mm. uh, separately in this video. Uh, but more importantly, Chinese M2 has grown from $1 trillion worth of RMB yeah. to, as you say, $30 trillion on an economy of 12. Yes. They've printed more money internally yeah. than any one country in the history of the world as a percentage of GDP, yeah. um, and as a percent, as, as, as call it M2 growth versus GDP growth, nothing has ever come that close. Yeah. So they've created a false economy of yeah. RMB and the exchange rate in dollars. So you, you took us to another place. You took us to Hong Kong for a minute, yeah, yeah. right? Why does Xi's little colony of Hong Kong mm. still peg to the dollar if China's economic model is so great? Yeah. Why, why is that? Very easy the answer. Sir, you know, Kale, Hong Kong dollars, we, you know, is the dollars, uh, Hong Kong dollar is the American dollars, the, the US dollars, the region. It's a peg. The peg. Yes. You know, bank re, re, reef, China reef, you know, reserve, reserve China. Yes, the PBOC. Uh, PBOC yes. and the Hong Kong bank reef. 
Yes. Receive. Norman Chan, A Norman H K M A. Yes. These are fake. These are true. You how can handle this? Right. Bank of China, Hong Kong handles. You both the same. Yeah. Same. Same. This is the mafia group. Same. Right. Bank of China is laundering money to the station. Yes. I your, your, your allegation is that the Bank of China, Hong Kong launders money for all of the for all of the Chinese leadership. Yeah. Always. You look go to New York. You say Bank of China the building. The Bank Small of China. the building. building. Yeah. All the windows are blocked. Always <laughs> three really? hundred sixty five days. I didn't you go know to that. See. You go to see. Okay. So I, I talk a lot of American friends. You say, go see Bank of China, never open the windows. Hmm. But the small the building, why is it that more than 2,000 employees work here? How can put 2,000 employees there? Why? This is spy system, laundry system. It's a mafia group who work there. They're not really bank. So the Bank of China, the bank of China in, in New York, all the world has 2,000 employees, and they are doing. You're saying they're doing everything from being spies to being mafia to being uh, um, uh, money laundering. Yeah, so this is for sure. So, sir, this is this is why I give you the answer very easy. Hong Kong, the dollars now they because the China, all the propaganda, you know, clean all the Hong Kong people the head. You want you trust? We can help you. You can push, you know, stronger Hong Kong dollars, but at least still, it's the control the uh, foreign, you know, currency go yes. outside. Yes. But now it's a big trouble. Big trouble. Because President Trump, you know, give the world, you know, training the uh, say no U.S. the training war, put the economy down. Mm. Well, the economy was already slowing. Yeah, very slow. Before before we went into. Trying to, input a, trying to put together a border adjustable tax or a tariff yeah. um, has just made it a little worse. The timing of the Trump administration's mm. tariffs is not good for China. Yes. I don't know if it was intentional or not. Very bad. Right, but it's very bad. But when you go back to Hong Kong, Norman Chan and the HKMA, mm. they've spent 78% yeah. of their reserves, yeah. excess reserves, fighting the peg. Yeah. This peg's been in place for more than 30 years. Yeah. And now... Hong Kong imports U.S. monetary policy, so they're having to raise rates while China's economy slows down. Mm. This could be a very big problem for Hong Kong, yeah? I think this is not a big problem. I think I want to go back and see this. China is, a, you know, because of American with China, they're training the war. Yes. China, not economy, no good. It's a go-to jump. Okay. So you're saying that the trade war is going to cause Chinese economy to drop? Yeah. So the which Hong was already Kong, dropping before the trade war. Dropping, so the why Hong Kong the bank now is very weak. They have two choice: make a fake economy, same China mainland. Yes. Second, is to open the close. We are die. We know more the dollars foreign. You mean uh, you basically liberalize the RMB? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let it let it free. Yeah. So this is why Hong Kong dollars look last the month. Down, down, China mainland CCP is try hope back, yeah. hope back, but nobody can rescue the Hong Kong dollars can't jump. One day CCP find out the solution, no Hong Kong dollars. No Hong Kong. Your, your assertion is that at some point in time China will just take over Hong Kong. This, this is the this is the goal. Yes. This is the goal. They want to try disappear Hong Kong dollar, then army be challenger American dollars. Right. This is fundamental the reason. Don't talk to me about the sea. So South China Sea War. Don't talk to me that you know all you the business you know say no U.S. the the tree the trail no important. The one goat, Challenger American dollar, disappear Hong Kong dollars. Okay. They want. They want to challenge the supremacy of the U.S. dollar. Yeah, this is why they yeah. first the one disappear Hong Kong dollars, then Challenger American dollars. So at the last Party Congress. Mm -hmm. um, Basically, there were far few chairmen of companies added to the standing committee in the committee of the Politburo, mm -hmm. right? Less corporate interest, whether they were heads of SOEs or heads of private, quasi-private companies, mm -hmm. much less business people on the standing committee in the, in the, in the Politburo. Mm -hmm. Is Xi trying to send a signal? Is he trying to change the, the structure of the standing committee and the, and the Politburo himself and take take out business interests and make it more uh, 
the thought of Xi. How, how do you think about what happened there at the Party Congress? So, okay, I want you to qualify. I need to translate. Okay. I pay him too much to translate sure, the fee. Sure, <laughs> Sorry. sure. Uh,做这个,呃,私人生意的这个,呃,业务,这个人员的代表,越来越少。嗯,那您觉得这个,现在这个,党的他的这个,共产党他们的这个想法是不是想越来越把这个,呃,私人企业,民营企业,呃,越
never give you payback. I see. So, so investors in China are the ones that uh, lose their money. This is for and sure. And the leadership gives a solution where they take what's left. Yes. And the institutions fail. Yes, this is sure. Yes, definitely. Okay. So this is why you can say the P2P. So if that happens, though, if that happens, how do how does the leadership control the population from uh, revolting? How does a revolution not happen? You know, this is in a why, big. In, let's say a lot of banks fail. Yeah, this is why if you see the last five years, what has happened? Cyber control. In the world, more you know better to North Korea. China cyber control the five years. Cyber control. Cyber control. Why? Yes. What do you fear? Why do you want the people afraid? To talk? They fear a revolution. You fear a revolution. Yes. This is the reason. And few months ago, talk the with blue, the scandal, sexy, steal the money. Just this. It's why we're in an airplane hangar, right? We can't yeah. be out in the public because <laughs> God, God knows what would happen to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this is why you know chaos, sir, chaos. Yes. This is why China, you know, how can control? The revolution, cyber control first. Second, you look the GDP, the how much pay call uh, inside security control. Mm. How much? You see this, hundred billion dollars. This is from GDP. Is control all the poor people, normal people, P 2 P. The people they don't rest the any leader family. They, they all the rest of the good people. Mm. Send the good people to yes, jail. Yes. This is why CCP is the world is the mafia group. And the way that they've been able. So what's fascinating about this big financial experiment that the, the, the Communist Party is engaged in, they control the narrative, right? They control the press. Mm -hmm. They control the people. Mm -hmm. They control the price level, mm -hmm. right, of various things in China. They mm -hmm. control food prices. They control energy prices, and and. In the end, they also that's how they control the economy and control the people from revolting. And what you're saying is, if the economic gravity mm -hmm. hits China, which it looks like it's hitting now, uh, given the fact that they're now running a current account deficit and things are slowing down very quickly, mm -hmm. that you think that they won't be able to control all of these things. Yeah. Is that so, correct? Yes, correct. So you know, the current part not only control this, they control everything. Mm. Including sexy. Including what? Sex. 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 Okay, right. China philosophy is the last four years. Three, three. three things. One, everything, the country, everything belongs to party. They party belong are, to don't oh, see the party. Belong to country. Everything belongs to party. Okay. Everything by listen to party. This is everything listen is the party give you. So you, you need to project. Three, even your father, your mother, no, not good to bad into party. Everywhere in China. I see. So they, they control what? Your father and mother, you cannot love your father and mother, loyalty. Why? You need to love the party. You love your party more than your family. <laughs> yeah. Then it says, who give you everything? Party. Mm. What is you 100% listen? Party. Mm. This is ridiculous. Mm. Why American, all the media, why is the world, a civilized world, no one media talks about the three Rugen. In the China, everywhere, you ask the other people, do you can trust the one party? Better than your father, your mother? Right. Well, no. <laughs> no. Why is everything you, your party give you impossible? This is a perfect segue. 